Hello, internet. So yeah, um, this is a video here about the YouTube Career Academy course, Quick Start Guide to YouTube, and all the lessons therein, and how I am going to, or in the future, going to apply them to my channel. So let's get started. I took a couple of notes. That being said, this is a very dense, um, like a lot of rabbit holes here to like just go down when like you're on each section or listen to the course to like click a link and it'll take you somewhere. You like read a bunch of stuff. There's a bunch of videos. It's there's there's a lot of ground to cover. So I honestly, after like a while, was like thinking I would like just like not do this and just like quit and like stop and like not do the series because it's there's a lot. But then I was like, dude, I'll just go ahead and do it just so I can like bang it out and be like I did it. Because there's a lot of cool stuff that like it does cover, at least in this first section, where it's like I hadn't thought about it in a long time because it's just the basics. So it's like when you're first beginning, it's like kind of neat to get like you know, go through here, and see the uh, like the stuff when you're first starting out, like the tips it gives you. So that's pretty cool. So um, yeah, this is just like an overview here on this this first part of like what it's going over. So like a welcome, the basics, branding, and then the introduction to policies and guidelines, and then like each one goes over them. So I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna go through like each of these really as like a really brief overview, and I'm just gonna like consult my notes at the end because there's a lot in each section, and I don't wanna like get too, like, I, like, like the way my notes are and like the way that it's structured is kinda hard to keep track because it's, it kinda goes a lot of places every, every section on the course in each lesson. So, um, but yeah, these first parts here, it's pretty, it's pretty interesting because it's like, you know, when you're first starting your channel and it's like, what do you want to do with it? It's like, it's like, a, it's like, a, it basically like tells you that your channel is a uh, conduit to like, you know, connect people or inspire people and all this other stuff, which I hadn't really thought of in a long time as far as like, you know, why am I doing this? It, or like, you know, my, my reason for doing it isn't as like grandeur and um, benevolent as like, oh, I want to make change and like inspire people and blah, blah, blah. It's like so basic and boring compared to like all the, the big ideas presented here. Um, let's see what else. Yeah, like if you click on like the art, art brand mission video, that's, that's pretty interesting. Um, da, 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 like the part where it's like pursue your creative passion. Like, like it's like interesting going through this section because I had not thought of this in a long time as far as like why like you know the it's still like the very like it strips away all the like fluff I feel like that I've added to my channel over years as far as like you know gone in so many different like branching paths of like what am I doing as opposed to just like focusing like an, on a very like core specific group of uh, ideas or um, functions so I was like hmm I kind of go to go, go back to like the basics here and like think about this because I hadn't thought about it in a while, so it's kind of neat and refreshing to do that after having done this for like such a long time and then coming back to be like, hmm, yeah. Because like you know, here <coughs> here's some bullet point questions. You know, it's like, how do you like to have an impact? What do you want to say? What knowledge can I can you share with others? And like, what are your who are your favorite YouTube creators and what makes them memorable to you? So that's pretty neat. Um, and then, like, this just shows, like, how basic this part is at the very beginning when it's, like, showing you, like, the quick start stuff of, like, you know, how to make a, <laughs> how to make a channel and upload a video and all this basic stuff. It's kind of, kind of neat. Um, da -da 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 -da. Yeah, like, this, I think this video here is, like, getting, like, your first hundred subscribers. So, like, when I saw that, I was, like, man, I'm, like, so far beyond this. Um, I mean, as far as, like, subscriber count, but then it's, like, the, the lessons that you get from this is it's still applicable and like you're still learning things so it's not like com like completely useless there's still there's still things you can take from it and apply to your channel or like where you're at like no matter how far you are so it's, it, it is like still valuable information um let's see what is this part about so yeah like it, here's more deep like basics like when you upload a video you should give it descriptions and then stuff about people watching it, watch time, subscriptions, algorithms. It's kind of like tied into these two parts. Because it basically says like, you know, a subscriber is someone that will go back to your channel multiple times to watch videos. And then you want your subscribers to like watch 
for longer times, you have like high watch time, and then if you have higher subscribers and higher subscriber retention and high ra watch time rates, that's how you get to be more successful of a channel. And so, like, think of like strategies and stuff to like bring them back. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> and that's and that's what I just covered when I was talking about this. Like, cause I I did this yesterday, and like I wanted to make a video all day long, but I just kept putting it off. So all these ideas are in my head right now. So it's just like kind of flowing out like I'd, I'd like to make these as like like right after I'm done so I have like so it's like fresh in my mind because I try to take notes but there's like so much to cover here and then the thing is like like I was saying how like there's links that basically go like to every effing thing like that's why it's kind of crazy when you're going through these and, like if you click on any of these it just takes you to an entire different lesson of like of that part specifically of like what you're trying oh never mind that didn't that's weird Usually they do though. That, like this one right here probably will. Like yeah, I clicked on what is this live streams, and it's like some section in the ca academy about live streams and all that stuff, and it's just like super dense. Going A to Z is hard if you click on everything, which I stopped doing. So I was like, dude, if I click on everything, it's just gonna take me to another lesson, and then the flow is like broken, and I'm like, well, I was I was I was reading and learning about this thing, but now I'm on this thing. And it's like, I'd like to do this A to Z and not like completely get sidetracked. So it's like, dude, I gotta just not click on anything. But if I, but like, if, like, only if it's like absolutely necessary to get like some, um, some clarity on something or some, some more concise, uh, like details and everything in descriptions. It's like, whoa, this was very, like I said, it's just a very dense rabbit hole and stuff. But yeah, it's, it's gonna say like, congratulations on all these because I've already done them. Like, each, each section is actually like like three questions at the end, it like quizzes you, and it's like, okay, well, what do you learn? Or what's this, what's this, what's this? And then it's like, oh, okay, at the end. Um, wait a minute, is this the end? Is this the final part? Because that seems like it's not the final part, no. Wait, is this branding? Which one is this one? Oh, basics, okay, yeah, branding. Man, branding, crazy. Like, looking at this one, it's like, my, my channel is just like so bad. When I like looked at this section, I was like, dude. My brand is like bad. I need to like go back and redo a lot of things, or just fix a lot of things or something. Uh, but yeah, it's like you know the set of unique characteristics that separate your channel from the rest and communicates your key messages and content strategy. And I was like, dude, I don't even I don't even know, because even like even like even like yeah like some of your basic stuff that I have on my channel that's like I didn't. I guess since I haven't gone back and like looked at all these, or just like I didn't look at these to begin with, or it's been a while since I've like brushed upon this stuff. Completely forgot about like the whole the branding thing, but it's like you know right now my channel icons my face, which is like could definitely be changed to something else. It's not really I would say indicative of like the content on my channel, so I, I definitely don't want to get around to changing that. Um, I'd say my art banner banner though. I think my my channel's loaded here because I was gonna make an example later, later on, but like I think that's pretty accurate. It's just like you know person playing games it's actually funny because like, i have a couch and i usually sit in front of the couch and not on the couch too so it's like haha that's actually funny because it's accurate um description i think i need to fix that yeah my, my description and my trailer are kind of like i think out of date right at this point just because i made this like a, a while ago and i haven't come back to update it and there's a lot of content on here that i have on here that i don't really do right now that i could probably you know try to do but it's like basically right now i'm just only doing like gameplay and streaming and it's like not as much podcasting and comic stuff so it's like oh i just need to like make some adjustments there and then trailer my, my trailer is also needing work because it's like i said it's also probably a bit out of date it's from let's see august of last year and so like from there like where i'm at there to where i'm at now Making similar content, but like not across the board all the same. So I definitely need to do some work on that. Um, dude, there's, yeah, all these videos too, like go into detail everything. And I watched all of them. So it's like, you know, they're also good uh, resources for information on like all this stuff. Cause it, it's definitely like, if you're getting a bit, you feel like you're, you're a bit overwhelmed. You can like watch these and they do a decent job of um, going over all the information or just going into more detail yada 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 but yeah here's um the section on like policies and guidelines which is pretty funny because it's 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 a lot of 
it's a lot of like the the flash points that people bring up with the platform as far as like you know if they like you know censorship and flagging people deplatforming like it's all here oh it's not all here but it's like you know there's a lot of this stuff in here but like the way it's presented is very interesting because um like this this video i shared it on twitter yesterday it's like basically like some you have some sock puppets well not sock puppets but they are puppets and it's like very humorous take on like the copyright thing but like this the this, this, this subject is so serious and there's like so many people that have like you know had issues with this on their channel it's like everyone's very surprised that like that's the way it, like it was presented um and then content id i have like a ton of issues with this on my channel i want to eventually get around to making it that video where it's like just they do go over it and it is you know to an extent clear but man it's just it's it's weird it's weird it's, it's hard to describe but it, it seems like it's uh you know the example they give and then like the real world like scenarios aren't aren't like one to one it's really like oh this well, well in this video you're showing but then like when it actually happens uh, uh, I think I might have like just brushed over a lot of stuff in this video but I'm just gonna keep going it's whatever so I just keep looking like clicking on these and like going like I'm not really looking over them I'm just like okay what is this what is this what is this but if I did that the views would be like 30 minutes and yeah <laughs> Okay, maybe they wouldn't, but it's like, it's, yeah, it's like, you can just like go to the academy and like, look, look check it out yourself. I'm not going to like go over each section and be like, oh, this is this, this is this, this is this, and then this is how you apply to your journal. I'm just gonna like, okay, here's a, here's a brief overview, and here's some things I'm looking at on like trying to, to apply them to my channel to fix it. It's essentially what, what, what I'm getting, trying to do with these. Um, but yeah, it's just talking about like, you know, when you have content ID, copyright issues, or your stuff's being flagged for being inappropriate, or... What happens when it's age restricted, or why it gets age restricted, and all that stuff? Uh, yeah, like I said, age restricted, and then monetization, and like how you even get to like this threshold for the partner program, and all that. Du -du 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 -du. But yeah, here, dude, like I said, like all these sections <laughs> are gonna go somewhere else on the website. These aren't all actually, um, I don't think lessons. I'm looking at the URLs in the, in the window and it actually is not going to load in a sec, a, a, le a, a lesson. So it's like, these are just, yeah, the stuff and stuff of, or not this, no, wow, stuff, words, Chris, you know, these are just the, each topics page and where to go to get more information about them on the website and covering those topics but like i said it's, it's a rabbit hole dude like there's so much it's so dense and it covers a lot and this is just the first lesson like this is just the first course so i'm really interested to see if like after the first first course if it gets less or more um what's the word for that branching as far as like just taking you to other places outside of that course that you're on because it was really somewhat overwhelming honestly like doing this yesterday at some or at least at some points it felt like that but then I think that's my own fault because I was like oh dude this is gonna be super easy because um because like on the description right it says like two hours or something and in my brain I'm like oh okay I can just sit there for two hours and like totally get this done but like I I was getting side sidetracked and distracted all day yesterday, so it's like it took me a while to get this done. And then I was like, okay, I did it. And then I wanted to make a video like this one, but then I went to um, I didn't do anything actually, I didn't, or I didn't go to do anything. I was, it was like almost ray time for Destiny, and I was like, dude, I guess I'll jump on PS4 and like do this. But then I I never came back to do this video, so it's like I I need to like get better at like setting or uh, setting aside time to do these and then getting them done without distractions and that's definitely a goal for me um but yeah like i said at the end it gives you this exam and then uh where's we could take the exam and then after you take it and you pass because i've passed here so this is my letter of completion it'll say you've gotten through this course well it doesn't say that but like you know it says letter of completion awarded to which i thought was weird because it doesn't have your name or your whatever it's just like it blank there and you can like print it out i guess and put your name on it i don't know and then like the course that you did 
and then the date that you did it so that's that's kind of neat and also i like i scored it with 100 percent, so that's pretty awesome i wanted i wanted to like record this as i did it to be like yeah i got 100 percent, and then you know not ha not have people like not believe me like oh we probably just like uh memorize the answers and then like went back and redid it a bunch of times so next next time totally doing it in video and just like yeah have it documented be like yep but um that's what you get when you do the course and you get the score thingy and i think on the thing never mind i thought i could have sworn like somewhere i was looking and it said something about like you've already passed or like it had like a thing that like showed that you had cleared it but as i guess like when you click on it and it says here it's got like a check mark so you know that you've done that one already but i was also looking through these and there's 20 something in these <laughs> i don't remember the exact number there's 20 something of these like these when i go through each section i'm like well next i guess i'm being content strategy next obviously i'll just start at the beginner then go to mirror then advanced before i move on to the next one but like each each course or a uh, category it's got like a bunch there's like 20 something but then when i clicked on catalog uh there's actually a couple more than all the ones listed there because there's 28 here i'm not sure how or how many are in the other one but there's like 20 i'll say like 23 25 maybe 26 but then i like went here and counted them all up and there's like a couple extra so when i'm done with all of those i'll go go into here and like see which ones i haven't done and i'll just do those but that's the first one out uh for first yeah first one and it's done so there's that's the uh quick start guide done but um what is this okay so let me look at my notes here so um wow i have notes but then i just totally didn't disregard them when i was reading because all i have on my notes is like channel creation platform to share stories engaging your community which is i guess what, what the whole channel thing is and like why you'd want to make a channel something in there about mission statement but I, like i don't even remember what it is or i, I totally glossed over it when i just did this recap all right next thing i have is watch time is important subscribers drive watch time because they watch the most of your videos the longest which i said so i'm just gonna go over that and then use titles and descriptions that are searchable and relevant metadata which is definitely something i need to uh fix on my channel but then i just made another uh word document on my phone to like have channel adjustments and that's what it's called so basically every course i go over i'm gonna like put in here like what i need to like do or fix or do better as i'm like looking at the the course and like seeing okay what can i apply to my channel but basically all i have on here is section improvement and um i skipped over it dang it hold on it's i think it's in branding it's like it says something about section or channel sections because i was like hmm i need to work on channel or the sec or the thing 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 I don't know where it's linked from no because this is the part where i clicked on and it like took me to this something about playlists i think it's in branding let me try to find it real quick so i like want to like see the specific part where i clicked on to like go to the thing oh here it is yeah it's like it's it's under here where it's like share your brand where places like what you have a handful of videos on your channel other tools to consider are cards in screen sections and playlists so i clicked on that which took me wow it's effing never mind i thought it took i thought it sent me to the same tab it opened a new one we're good so it took me to this one which is the one that's open here so i can just close that one and out the uh t in the get discovered course yeah so just close that one and then the, like here it says use section help your uh help your viewers find more so i already have sections on my channel but then like going through this part i was like hmm i could do sections probably better and then i then it like has an example on here of this uh superwoman's channel so i went there it actually like plays a video but like the video is like completely unrelated it was just like an example video it didn't actually like show the um the sections thing so that's what that's what it was but it didn't so then i clicked on this and that took her took me to her channel which actually shows that it's got a bunch of sections here uh, under the uh, the uh, I forgot what these are called <laughs> the highlighted video or whatever so there's like sections where it says latest uploads skits uploads types of people parents lols parents react 
Battle of the Sexes, collaborations, and other stuff. So it shows like a dent bunch of sections here. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. At least eight if you don't count the uploads and the the uh which two there. Oh that's not really a section, but I guess it's probably a section, but like those seem like they're just there by default. So then I went to my channel to like look and see, you know, just to see like, you know, okay. I do have sections, but I need to fix them. Because in my opinion, I could, I could, like, I feel like I could put more on here or just have them better organized. So then in my brain, I was like, okay, what am I going to do here? And so I was like, okay, well, let me strip out these bottom three because I haven't updated them in a long time. Like, I haven't added anything to cinematically disappear in a long time or never gets old or boss fight. And then it's just like, you know what? I can just, like, in general, just, um, like, better organize these. Like even let's plays and playthroughs, I haven't added to this in like a long time, and I'll probably just put it at the bottom. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put each section is a different platform. Just put like Nintendo, PlayStation, Xbox, you know, and then have some like maybe like streaming, and then like let's play some playthroughs, and at the very bottom have uh, like my most viewed. Well, no, those would be at the top, I guess, because I think that's what this section's at. It's got like all my views, I have like a ton of views. Because <laughs> if only they all had 235,000, right? That one's, yeah, that's why that one's there. And it's just, I, but then I'm not sure if these are like organized. I think the ones that are like this one where it's like popular, it's like an automatic algorithm thing where like it just puts in like all the stuff that's got like the highest stuff. So it's like you don't have to do that one. Or like where it says uploads, like these are the ones that are newest videos, essentially. So I'd probably actually put this above that one. So it has like the newest stuff up top. Um, yeah, like newest stuff, popular stuff, and then just like sections by platform, and then what, well, that's dang it. I want to put my vlogs in there though, so I guess I'll put the vlogs at the bottom because I don't make as many as those as I make gaming videos, so it's not really as it's like the we <laughs> well, I don't want to say it's the weakest tier of my branding, but it probably is. So it's like yeah, and then my trailer I need to fix, and then my um derp derp description I might I might fix we'll see I, I don't really think I need to like adjust it that much but like if you if you're wondering I'll go ahead and close this tab and this tab like how to get to that part that part where you like fix things so this is like the part where I was like okay let me actually I can actually like make some like uh that's like why I'm doing this now like I said I wouldn't do the the share the sh the shadow play stuff but then it's like it actually, it actually makes more sense if I do this like this, so like click on your, like how to get to the whole, whole part where you, where you would fix that, or you know, how would you get to the part where you fix your sections here? That's what I'm gonna do today, or over, <laughs> I guess not today, today. Um, well, hold on, I didn't load in my channel, like it's, my channel, it's like it's, I'm looking at this now, like, like it says ask subscribers, so I'm not sure why it, it did that, but um, <laughs> hold on. But basically, you click on custom my channel though. I'm gonna go to a different thingy, and then I'll, I know I can get there from here, or I'm sorry, here from there. And then if I click go to Aimless, because I know that I'm a featured channel there, and I click on mine, and it shows me my channel, and I'm on my channel. And I can just yeah, like this is like how you're how um, because like there used to be an option to like click something like where you load it in as like that you're viewing it as a sub or you're viewing it as a subscriber or someone new to your channel can find that part. So whatever, I'm not worried about it. But like, if you click on this custom my channel blue button, and then it'll give you the all the prompts and tools and whatnot to uh oh here you go. Well, I mean that's not going to help me here because yeah, but um, but this lets you like view it if you're like a new view visitor or viewer to your channel, like what they see. So I know I'm out of spaces because it's not letting me add anything else as far as the sections. And then, um, and then like subscriber view. So, yeah. But, um, definitely going to do some work here. <laughs> Change some stuff, fix some stuff, add some stuff, take away some stuff in the sections. And, yeah. I mean, I'll probably, I'll probably keep these playlist I just won't have them be on the sections at the front where they're featured which honestly I haven't even like I haven't done this in a while <laughs> gone in and like fixed all this stuff or like adjusted things so 
I'm I'm glad I went through over, over that course so I can like be like okay well, let me get this done after you know probably like years of like wanting to do it and then not doing it like or putting it off or just forgetting or just not you know being like oh I'll get around to it later or whatever you know it's like that's kind of like one of the things of this series is I can like finally go back and like do stuff I've been like wanting to do my channel but then like I forgot it at some point because I didn't write it down or something and then I'll finally like since I have this word file open on my computer or my phone I can just go go in and put like okay well what am I doing and then section improvements like number one and then I can just do that and I'll do the next course do the same thing just like and just just go from there and I did say yesterday I think or no I didn't I don't I don't think I know I said that that like uh, I try to do one of these every day but that's not gonna happen like these these are too dense and too like I said like so many rabbit holes that you can fall down and just like they cover so much ground each 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 course even though it does say like you know each some of them do say that they're not very long like uh like this is two hours this one's 45 minutes but i'm not on that one so like this one's three hours so that's gonna take a while for sure but so yeah so <laughs> so yeah no, not every day i'm just gonna get get them done where they're done and put them up as i do them and go through them and then as i'm doing them apply the stuff to my channel like i'm doing today when i go to someone else's or like I'm, i like you know, go to the section thing, and it's like, okay, well, like your sections, and here's how they work, and how to make them better, blah blah blah. And then I'm like, okay, let me let me apply that to my channel, and then go in and do that stuff. But yeah, like I was I was saying the other day also that there was somewhere where it had the um like the things on the side that like for you specifically to like go in and like if you say like you know all these channel tips like that they pop up that says watch video hold up. There's a thing somewhere. That's not it. That's gonna show show analytics probably. I imagine. So that's not the that's not what I want. But like some of these, they will pop up and like lead to lessons in the um, academy, I think. But then, they they don't go in order. It's just like where you're at with your channel at that point in time. Like this is where I'm at. Like you know, I don't know what where. This is like if this is advanced intermediate or expert level, but it's like specifically for my channel of like where I'm at I need to like be looking at the super chat things and I stream a lot but I haven't done this course obviously there's no check on the <laughs> done and there's still an exam thing so yeah and Alex is just a thing to show your uh well this is like a behind the scenes in the dashboard thing or not behind, it's a on the back end on like the dashboard on your channel so it's not really it's something that's easy to get you it get to if you don't know where it's at so yeah, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Like I said, I'm just going through each course, and, and like that blue customized channel button, you can just it, whenever you find it. I don't think it matters like where you're at. It's like you're looking at your channel as you or somebody else. But like that's the, yeah, it's like the, yeah, there, there used to be like this thing right here. Where it's like you know, views yourself, a new visitor, or turn subscriber, and that used to be on like the edit channel button outside of this, but. It's whatever, dude. I'm not super worried about it. Okay, this is weird because I just clicked on these two and it like check marks them, even though I didn't. Even, I didn't even do anything. It's just like I. It's, it's, it's whatever, man. But I think that's how I got to the. Never mind. I was gonna say that's how I got the idea about the the thing, cause the academy, because like if you click on one thing and like send you to the academy thing, and it's like they're all there, but then no, that's not that's not the link. There's probably like one wall back or some at some point in time. But anywho, that is it for this video. Um on the YouTube Academy and the course. I forgot the name, I'm gonna have to look it up real quick here. <laughs> wow, it, oh yeah, yeah, okay, getting started, what's another, okay, the, the quick start guide to YouTube course, and then it's an, a brief overview, not in detail, like I don't think I went over all that stuff in there for that, that course and then like how I'm taking that and applying it to my channel and then trying to show that and then I'm going to do that with each course there's like 20 something of them so there's at least 28 there might be more by the time I'm done with this who knows so yeah that's that's going to be a thing I'm not sure how many I'll get done every week or month so I'll just try to get them done when they're done and hopefully everybody enjoys them and they can help them make adjustments on their channel that they need to make too or just you know be more successful on their channel and, and on YouTube 
so you know that's that's it for the video so feel free to leave a like comment subscribe favorite share it with your friends or not that's cool too and until you see or hear from me again thanks for watching and i'm now <laughs> once this overlay pops up wow okay i should i, I try to time it really good but then my computer doesn't want to work with me here oh my gosh I'm trying to end the video, and it's, it's not, yeah, it's not being cooperative. Oh my gosh, isn't it like Alt-Z or something? I don't know, there it is, okay, so yeah. Thanks for watching, and listening, and I'm now signing off.